Okay, Sean Webb Golf here, and today we're doing a before and after of uh, one of my students. Um, on the right here was actually about a year ago, and, and the results here on the, on the left, the video we shot today indoors. It's kind of cold out, so we had the door down. Um, but on the before, let's just do the down the line motion here. Just tend to get the club and the arms way too far inside too early. Kind of lifted the arms to the top. Got that club coming much too far. This is about 10 to 12 degrees into out at this point. She tended to hit really bad um, heel and toe shots really. Pushes and hooks. You see kind of an early extension here. Not much rotation through the ball. Really shut and just standing up with her lower body. <clears throat> so she, she struggled to be consistent um, on the golf course and also had really poor contact at times. So here's the move that we came up with after a lot of work. We'll kind of take it back here halfway to show you where we are now. She keeps the arms a lot more out in front. <clears throat> so kind of middle, middle of the chest here when the left arm's parallel. So there we go there. Top of the swing now. Got the left arm covering the right shoulder, basically maintains her um, inclination to the ground very well. You can see a pretty dramatic kind of dropping here and the club coming from the inside. She loses a little bit of height. And then now basically starts rotating back to the left, maintains her body uh, inclination really well. And then you're gonna see the early extension, no rotation with the shoulders and hips. And the kind of a, you're going to see a highish exit with the face rolled over, the head still down, and now you see this club working around the corner here really nicely. Uh, club face not as turned down to the ground. Okay, now for the face on view, we'll go to the before on the right. She tended to overturn early with her body. She tended to keep this left knee. Um, and this whole left leg rotated inward too long, which, which made it real difficult for her to open her hips up to the left. And you can see how she just jumped and basically flipped at it with no real rotation here. She made a huge lateral slide and got the, the hip joint kind of outside the ankle here, which I really don't like to see. And that caused the head to stay glued down. So we'll run through that again. Keeps this, le this left knee in internal rotation, never rotates this leg and femur out. Very hard to turn from there, basically just slides and slaps at it with her arms. <clears throat> now, good looking move to the top. You'll see that left leg work differently, works outward a little bit more in transition, starts rotating right away. When she does that, the chest goes with it, the head rotates with it into the finish. Much better rotation, head motion through the ball. Very clean, powerful swing. She hits it about 260 with the driver now uh, and way more consistent. So a lot of mechanics work there, but very clean looking swing now. Hits a lot of fairways and um, she has become a very good player. So anyway, that's kind of what you can do if you give some time to the mechanics. Again, that was about a year change. Um, so. Uh, give your swing some time if you're working at it. You can see the results if you're working on the right things. Um, and you'll, you'll see the fruits of all that labor. So anyway, I just want to do that quick before and after. Thanks.